Hi, it's Dr. David Green, founder and CEO of R3 Stem Cell, the nation's leader in regenerative medicine therapies. Today I want to talk about something that I hear all the time when I go around the country doing seminars, and that is the question of PRP therapy, is it a stem cell therapy? And the answer is an unequivocal no. PRP, which stands for platelet-rich plasma therapy, is a regenerative therapy. What I say is that it falls underneath the um, regenerative umbrella, but it is not a stem cell therapy. So PRP comes from a simple blood draw, just like you would have at the lab, okay? But when you take peripheral blood, there aren't that many stem cells in it at any one point in time. So when you spin it in the centrifuge machine, and then you actually pull out the PRP therapy, which let's say you start with 30 cc's, the PRP is going to be about 5 cc's, you are not going to have enough stem cells in that amount to call it a stem cell therapy, okay? So if you call a clinic and they say, oh yeah, we offer a form of stem cell therapy called PRP, no, it's not. That is a misnomer and it can be misleading because you, you might think, oh, well, I can get a PRP therapy, which is a stem cell therapy for like $800, and I don't understand why these other clinics are charging a few thousand. Well, there's a reason for that. Okay, when is PRP therapy used? A lot of our centers will use it in conjunction with the stem cell therapy to help boost and potentiate the activation of those regenerative cells. Okay, or it can also be used in the case of an overuse or a sports injury condition like a tendonitis, uh, like of the rotator cuff or a heel pain from plantar fasciitis, tennis elbow. It can be very effective for things like that. All right, I hope that clears it up. Visit us today at r3stemcell.com. We have over 35 centers around the country. You can also call us at 844-GET-STEM, and we'll get you in for a free consultation at a center close to you. Thank you.